uh, painting clouds are a real challenge to people. Now, all I'm going to do again is show you the technique, and then you can take it and study it. Now, I'm going to switch to a little number, this is a number eight bristle brush, and I'm going to kind of clean it out a little bit. I'm going to use pure gesso with a little bit of orange, just a touch, I mean just a slight tint. Just barely touch it. See there, just a slight tint. Now I'm going to do something that's going to scare you, but that's okay. That's kind of my job. Now watch what happens here. I'm going to take this whitish color, and this little orange tint here, and, and I'm going to do something here. Now most people panic when that happens, okay? I know it looks like a big bird flew over, but that's not what the case is here. This is going to be a cloud. Now watch this. You take that blob of paint, turn your brush sideways, okay, it's real important here, and you begin developing these beautiful white fluffy clouds. Now you see the secret here is to blend the base out so that it kind of creates a shadow by allowing your background to come through in a transparent form. So you just kind of gently scrub, and you leave areas that you want to be a little brighter just there. And that's all you have to do, and then you just keep building. Now watch how we build. So you want a cloud to be a little whiter, brighter, you just put it on. You blend it like that. And so this particular segment of your grouping here is your cloud study and your hill study. So you've got two things here that you can practice that are sort of go hand in hand and do this over and over several times. Now I'm going to do a little more, just keep watching, and then we'll move over to our other segment. Now say I want to come up here a little higher to create a better composition. You just put the paint in there and then you dry brush it using the side of the brush. Leave the top of it a lot lighter, and then you fade the bottom part out, see? And that's how you create the third dimension. Isn't that exciting? That just creates such a wonderful effect. 